the U.S. Air Force is sending six P-52 Stratofortress strategic bombers to fly over each of NATO's 30 members on Friday, a gesture meant to signal the alliance's unity. Four bombers, taking off from Royal Air Force Fairford in the United Kingdom, will pass over NATO's European members, according to a statement by U.S. European Command in Stuttgart, Germany. Two B-52s departing from Minot Air Force Base North Dakota, are scheduled to fly over the United States and Canada. This single-day mission, titled Allied Sky, is intended to demonstrate NATO solidarity, enhance readiness and provide training opportunities aimed at enhancing interoperability for all participating air crews from the U.S. and NATO allies, the European Command Statement read. Aircraft from 20 Alliance members are scheduled to provide aerial refueling and other support throughout the day, it added. Officials described the mission as a variation of the U.S. military's routine bomber task force flights. Sending nuclear-capable bombers airborne amid global crises is a key tool in the Pentagon's deterrence calculus. For U.S. Air Force pilots, the toughest training flights are going virtual. A new virtual training environment will help Air Force pilots prepare for war against countries like Russia and China. Current would-be hotspots include various points along NATO's eastern flank, such as the Baltics and the High North, where countries fear Russian forces are probing defenses. In addition, the popular uprising in Belarus against the country's Moscow-backed, autocratic president, Alexander Lukashenko, has the potential to spill into neighboring Poland or the Baltic states, all of which are NATO members. Time's fear of missing out. Sign up for the Early Bird Brief, the defense industry's most comprehensive news and information, straight to your inbox. Thanks for signing up. By giving us your email, you are opting into the Early Bird Brief. U.S. security commitments to the NATO alliance remain ironclad, General Todd Walters, the head of European Command was quoted as saying in the statement. Today's bomber task force mission is another example of how the alliance sustains readiness, improves interoperability and demonstrates our ability to deliver on commitments from across the Atlantic.